Alright, what's good YouTube? It's your boy Trent C. Back with another video. Today, your boy Jamari dropped another video. You know what I'm saying? And today, it's about Casanet. You know what I'm saying? Of course, y'all probably heard um this OnlyFans model tried to expose him. You know what I'm saying? Hey, you gotta do what you gotta do. You feel me? But um. We finna see what Jamari Tama and um, Kyle point of view on it and everything, so let's do it. So there was a situation yesterday where streamer Kai Sinat was basically being held ransom. Virtually, that is, by an OF girl slash corn star named Layla Red. These two apparently had a relationship at some point last year after he met her during a stream. Hey, where you at? You ain't here with me? I'm in the A2. Oh, not with me though. I know, that's why, that's why we here. Oh man, <laughs> he cheese the hardest a motherfucker, <laughs> bro. He cheese the hardest a bitch, bro. Like his ass trying to. Still got. And I guess things eventually got deeper for them. And now she is using their time together to try and publicly extort one of the biggest streamers right now. But she's so dumb that she didn't use the blackmail against him correctly. Yeah. She skipped way too many steps and went right to trying to expose him to the public. Not to even mention this man made her sign an NDA, so a lot of what she has done is illegal. She's saying things like Kai owes her hush money and that he allegedly even paid for her to sleep Hell with him. Nah. Well, I mean, since I'm going to court, I might as well link the the addy, the videos. Make sure y'all hit that link in my bio. Video coming soon. This woman reminds me a lot of that other corn star that tried to expose Zion What's her name? Williamson last I year and went on that ridiculous Twitter yeah, time where she made herself look absolutely horrible in the process. That all in an attempt Zion to expose Zion. Which was out here tagging the NBA and Adam Silver and shit, talking about she did a tornado trick on his eggplant. <laughs> and look at my boy Zion now, balling out once again. Yeah, now, when it comes so. to Kai. He did the best thing possible and immediately responded to these allegations and it turns into a pretty great reverse uno moment so this was the initial post that i saw about this situation yeah this is what i had seen i had seen the um the shit that was going around where kai allegedly sent her 5k you know what i'm saying for you know doing you feel me but they were like, they were like, Kai, I mean, Kai said like he, you know what I'm saying, do all, he ain't show the messages, but he showed. For it with this via Twitter, where I guess she was payments, pretty much payments. trying to promote her OF page, she like we saw ugly. Juice World's ex-girlfriend do recently. I mean, y'all know these OF girls are absolutely shameless. They'll do anything to get that dollar. And obviously I'm not going to show you these pictures because they're actually revenge corn obviously but she says full video of me and kai sanat link in bio it was so good too and let's be honest guys if you see your favorite streamer or rapper or some sort of bro they're going to buy that bitch bro like no cap they're going to buy that bitch no cap tanner famous person got their tape exposed on the timeline. If your first thought is to run and go watch it, to run and go pay for it, you need to seek some sort of psychiatric help. She also says when Kai know what to do when you come around. And this is where this $5,000 Apple payment allegation comes from, where she claims he was paying for the goodies. Now this is Kai's initial response. He would go on to absolutely flame her throughout the day. Here he's showing his Apple payment history. She saved yeah, that that's what I was saying. in my phone on God. This is from October 20, I mean, 2023, you know what I'm saying? And the shit she showed Lay Red was in my phone. April. Can you have a rush? I'm on you now. Can you have a rush? We don't. We call you KR now, all right? Go to November. See November, the $50. Stop. Stop! So as you guys can see, they're in the Apple Pay history. Lay the Red for $50, okay? And I guess he's basically trying to say here, no, I did not pay to smash some old retired corn star turned OF washed up woman. All I paid for Bruh. was the trip home. Lay the f***ing red! $50 for your f***ing dumbass Uber, bitch! I got your f***ing Uber, bitch! $50, bitch! 
What you talking about? Bro, the chat going crazy. Oh my god. Chat going so crazy. Obviously, Kai was beyond outraged in this situation. And he's really trying to go the extra mile here to not only clear his name, but to also expose this corn star. And I guess this was her response to him saying that all he paid for was the Uber, which she says, when the biggest streamer in the world pay for and lie to hide the truth lol she would then go on to share this message grown men pay for and listen guys i know they say grown all the time not to pussy, not judge bro. a book by its cover but if we can learn anything from the last couple videos bro if you paying if you paying for you know what i'm saying dang you i ain't gonna lie bro you just gotta be that down bad or something like no cap and I ain't like I don't I don't even expect how to you know what I'm saying be paying for pussy and shit because like he get bitches, you feel me? Like he don't gotta do all that, you feel me? Made it's that sometimes you have to use your brain and you can just literally sometimes. So see that's a woman why I ain't even believe it to start. And know what they're all about. Now here's where she continues to post this photo of Kaisenot nude in bed. It looks like she took this picture while this man was sleeping, and he basically. Trying to sue me after buying pussy is wild. LOL, you going to jail too, clown. You breached the contract, and so did I, I guess. Your bitch has be a sad right next to me. He has his junk out, and yes, this would qualify as revenge corn. She says, trying to sue me after buying pussy is wild. LOL, you going to jail too, clown. You breached the contract, and so did I. Guess your bitch ass a be in a cell right next to me. And she would even take to TikTok to drop this video response to Kai. Everybody keep asking me about all the dates, all the dates. See, he's not showing y'all shit from this year. I showed y'all last year and this year. He's just showing y'all last year and he's showing from another iCloud. See, that's how dumb people is. It's a Damn, wait, hold on. He didn't show this year, though. Damn. Oh, another iCloud, shorty. I'm showing proof from our most recent leak up, which was three weeks ago. Now, to be fair to her, do I think that someone with as much money, clout, and exactly. status as Kai Sinat would only have one phone that he's doing Apple Pay on? Absolutely not. Where he paid me to... Are you single? Maybe you're divorced or new in town. It's time hey, to man. meet your match with events and adventures. To delete anything that I had on him, which was the agreement, and I was cool with that. Wait, so did he pay you to delete information about him, or did he pay you to sleep with him? Because you're alleging two different things right now. Your story really is not adding up. You gotta understand, like, I'm in the industry. Everything I get is insurance. Peter Point Blake, I don't know y'all, I don't give a f and I'm gonna always protect myself at the end of the day. So, yes, I did collect insurance. You damn right, just like he did when he recorded my voice. And the insurance she's talking about is all these different materials that she had to expose him, like that picture of him laying naked asleep in bed. I mean, when it comes to Kai, he was just an absolute idiot for messing around with someone like this. Yeah. Like, the saying is very true. You lay down with dogs and you're likely gonna get fleas to act like you did never heard hey, that. bitch now you got me up and now i gotta expose you so basically what this woman is saying is that she wants to be viewed as a hooker she wants to be viewed as someone who is down for the pay for play i don't think that's the flex that she thinks it is i am about to post the transaction id for the payment that you just recently made to me i mean does anyone really care if kai went out and was tricking on this chick absolutely not <laughs> entertainers athletes people of status they're doing this stuff every single that day that is true though you're not lying women. normal women industry women corn stars i mean for these type of chicks i have to believe that's kind of like their whole game stop acting like you don't know why i'm doing this right now everything was cool until you didn't want to pay me my money my hush money and that's when it became a problem you made this a problem i can't lie to you guys this has to be one of the dumbest individuals that we've ever seen on my channel like she's trying to expose him but the whole time she's just exposing herself and her potential mini crimes she lucky you is giving yourself another charge dumb <laughs> <laughs> She even went out of her way to leak this man's number. All right. Oh, she leaked the nigga number? Here's the screen record for you guys. Up, down. Message. What the hell? Oh, shit. So 
Sorry about that, y'all. Hold on, give me one second. Alright, cool, we good? Sorry about that. Anyway, I'm gonna cut that out. But, um, I was trying to read it. I read it from my love, and I thought you said my friend was gonna sign. She said she ain't signing. Well, I didn't have to lie. And this clip right here would actually result in her getting banned from Instagram, which I'm sure like all the other OF girls, when it comes to promoting her page, you know, OF and Instagram go together like bread and butter. That's where they lure in all the simps. If I just would have got my money, I would have shut up. Well, you're definitely <laughs> not going to get your money now, chick. As a matter of fact, yeah, I've been definitely giving not you money now. portions of your paycheck to Kai Sanat for quite some time. And honestly, crashing out over like 5,000 bucks is definitely not f***ing worth it. Now, this is where Kai Sanat really becomes a savage in this situation. He took a page out of 50 Cent's book, and he's being extra petty with the people trying to play with his name. So, Layla, I have bought your domain. Now you might ask, what does that mean, Kai? It means Her website. every time somebody types in Kiara Rush, anytime somebody types in Layla Red, the first website that they would click on is all the lies you told me, all the crimes you've done, all the dumb shit you just put yourself in to f Bro, how life. did he do so that? No, your OF link won't pop up first. <laughs> Like that won't pop up first. Oh no, 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 no. The top link will be Kiana Rush, okay? Showing everything that you've done. So obviously the man is playing chess while this woman is out here not even playing checkers, okay? This bitch is playing like tic-tac-toe. Oh no. And this is what you see <laughs> when you go to these playing, websites oh, no. that Kai Sinat set up. Kiara Rush dot com. <gasps> oh my god! How we the got you, fuck? <laughs> <laughs> bro, Every Kai team is immaculate, bro. I can't even lie. Who messes up. Oh, wait, I don't know Kiawa's real name. Hold on, we don't know it. <laughs> oh, no. <gasps> no matter what, for the rest of your life, this will be here. Mm. I mean, I won't lie to you guys. That is a pretty damn good power play right there. It is. And apparently Kai I was even out lie. here smoking Kai's on that Layla fuck, Red bro. Pack, dancing around. I don't know. Kai's this smart as hell. Is hilarious. I mean, she really thought she was going to make him look bad. And she really kind of just turned this into a W for him. And then she has the audacity to try and allege some very serious allegations against him, even if it's a little bit tongue-in-cheek here. Oh, we're taking people to court? Well, she is. I'm ready to take you to court, little P. Diddy Jr., you talking about you trying to stand me to one of your homies and all that shit? Don't forget about it. I got all that in the teeth too. So she's calling him P. Diddy Jr. Insinuating that ain't make sense. he's a trafficker because he went to one of his boys and told people what she's all about. I mean, clearly she prides herself on being pay for play, but now she wants to act like it's some sort of Diddy situation when it's convenient for her. That doesn't really make a lot of yeah, sense. it's not a Diddy situation. Oh, man, of course he was gonna come back with a story saying he gonna sue me. How else was he gonna look good to the vlog? I mean, you like a certified trick right now. Duh. And you're what? A certified hooker and proud of it? Truly do not understand how an individual hey, man, that's crazy. low IQ. I mean, just look at the face there. It's not a <laughs> screaming Harvard graduate. But I wanna know what you guys think about this situation down below. Just yeah, y'all let me know what y'all figure. I mean, think about this situation down below. You feel me? I'm gonna leave this link, you know what I'm saying? If y'all wanna watch it, you feel me? And let me know y'all thoughts, comments, concerns on this situation. Um, I feel like Kai, Kai eating her ass up right now. I can't even cap. You feel me? But Kai did not show the transactions for this year. You feel me? Which has me a little skeptical and shit. You know what I'm saying? Which he don't really got to lie about. You know what I'm saying? Like, if you pay the 500, bro. I mean, five bands, fuck it. You know what I'm saying? You have not but yeah, that's how I feel about it. You know what I'm saying? Y'all make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe. And if you're new, subscribe. I'm out.